Your white position is ready position. So we're going to hold it here. Notice so I've got this about in front of my shoulder. To begin with, I rotate my hips. Come down for number one. Come up for number two. Three to the side. Four. Step up, step back. This is this rowing motion. Notice our narrow stance. So we're hitting here. And again, a fairly narrow stance. So we're not in a traditional forward bounce for empty hand. This looks like a down block. Okay. I'm going to switch hands by pulling my hand up here, come through. And I'm screwing, rotating this as I come in. Now May is back. Over. Back. So as these guys watch the video, they can see it. So number one, two, three, four, switching the hands, five, this is like a sweeping or rowing motion, six, seven, pull back, and it comes in. Okay, man? Now that's seven step. You can do it on another person. The only modification you'll make is when you do number one, you don't come straight down, but you come a little bit to the side, to the side of the head, the temple, instead of straight down. And one person has to go forward, the other person has to go back. So Mr. Barnett will step back, and I'll come forward. So again, we're coming in a more of a horizontal strike here so that we can actually make contact. seven step on the other person and I've already shown you how to do this when I was up in Tennessee so we're not going to go over a lot of the details but this gives you something that you can look at and try to remember the steps now we're going to do the one steps so I'll stand in a ready position and he'll go back in a striking position I'll yell to create the entry <laughs> stick because right now I can't reach him. But if I slide, I can. I've used the length of the stick again. Pull it back so that he can get up. Alright. Number two. side of my body. I'll fade back and take it here. I'm in a cat stance. I'm going to roll it up, over, and then come back in, strike into the throat. This could even be a takedown. And again, I'll carefully come back so that he can retreat. Now the third one that I showed you, Was the same strike. Okay. I'm striking here. I'm coming into the foot. So this comes in to hit the leg or the foot. And then come through to the head. That's the shuffle step that I took. From here, using the length of the weapon, stepping, stepping right here. Now let's go to the kata. I don't think I've showed you this when we were up in Tennessee, so I'm gonna have Mr. Barnett do Boichi, which is the first bow kata. Done in first four directions, and then it switches to uh, diagonal eight directions.
first four directions. Good, scoot back a little bit so you've got room. Then he's going to switch to the next four. Entire length of the weapon, so he's holding on to the very end. 